Alright guys, my name is Matthew Conger and you are watching The Small Chef 11. So guys, we are in a different and new kitchen and this is going to be the kitchen I'm going to be at for a while. So please bear with me with these first few videos, I'm just trying to figure things out. And today guys, we're going to start talking about how to make Thousand Island dressing or Big Mac sauce. It is the same thing. So let's get started. All right guys, so now when we're doing our dressing here for our Thousand Island, make sure you have everything ready to go. So I have here my minced onion, my ketchup, my mayonnaise, and my pickles. And down in the description below, I will have the ingredients that you need. So let's get this going. Now what we're gonna do here is we're gonna add our salt and pepper to our bowl here. Now I'm gonna add my salt. I'm gonna add in my onion. and my ketchup. And all we gotta do guys is stir it all together. Now if you guys don't like your pickles as chunky as I do or your onions as chunky, make sure you do a finer mince on it and you guys will be fine. All right, now let's try this and see what it tastes like. Alright guys, the one thing I did forget to add in and mention was you need to add some vinegar. All I have is apple cider vinegar. I prefer the white vinegar, but it just gives it that little bit of bite. It's about, I'd say, an ounce to two ounces. Stir it in. Needs a little more salt and pepper. Try it one more time. And then guys, this tastes really good. It tastes like Thousand Island dressing. It's delicious and simple to make. Just throw those things together. If you want more of a bite to it, make sure you add vinegar to it. It will definitely give it that bite to it if you want more of that. Now, what you can do with this is also throw it on some burgers, make a Big Mac if you'd like to, and use it for your salads. So I absolutely like making this homemade because it's delicious. I hope you guys make this at home. All right, guys, that is how you make a Thousand Island dressing or Big Mac sauce. And man, guys, it is absolutely delicious. Easy to make, you know, nothing too complicated. If you want to go a little more complicated, you could add some white vinegar to it instead of the apple cider vinegar I added. Or you can add some mustard to it to give it a little more tanginess if you want. Or, you know, there's a few things you can tweak it a little bit more, a little more pickles, a little less onion. So it's whatever you guys prefer. So just play around with it, have fun, and please just bear with me as I'm putting out these newer videos because I am starting off in this new kitchen. Thanks for watching, and if you guys are stopping in for the first time, please hit that subscribe button that's going to be over there. And also, if you're watching this on Facebook, hit that blue one up above. And you guys have an awesome day.